It may have been a wonderful day to take a stroll in the city, but certainly not on this stretch of road. It's slightly less than a kilometer long, but this stretch along Kahuho and Muhori roads has been a huge source of frustration and agony due to its poor state. The dire situation there forced Nairobi Governor Dr. Evans Kidera to take time off his busy schedule to inspect a project being undertaken by the county government along the Kahoho and Muhori roads. Wananchi of Dagoreti South who live around here have suffered for a long time and this is something that as a county government we cannot allow to happen. The excitement among the locals was almost tangible. And uh, once this whole once this was uh, our machines on the ground, uh, they, were very, they, were very, they were very excited. A director of engineering in charge of the project said the input of the public played a major role in the road's design. This project was actually developed by the residents themselves through the county consultative forum. Yes. And it will cost us about 69 million. Pedestrians too now have a reason to smile. We have a non-motorized transport component being implemented on the project. So it means that um, the pedestrians will have a very good walkway. The Nairobi governor has assured residents the project will be completed on time. Uh, projects come easier at Takikani Chukwe Muda because the inconvenience on Ainchi. We'll be back here to uh, inaugurate it uh, by the end of October. As you have heard it, the governor of Nairobi, Mr. Evans Kidero, has assured us and the residents that in four months' time, this road will be complete. That is by the end of October 2015. Valentine Wamboy, Citizen TV.